this is just on the street. <laughs> Salem. Why for our 10 year anniversary. Aww. We got married 10 years ago. 10 years ago. On Halloween. <laughs> it was the honeymoon that we never had. Yes. So we got to do that and it was pretty amazing. So here you are, ready to leave. At the Atlanta airport. No, this is Houston. This is Houston? Yeah, this is when we first started, 7 o'clock. Well, this, this is, is when we Atlanta. get to Atlanta and they had this cool. Biggest airport in the you world, can tell apparently. I just got off the airplane because <laughs> my hair is so jacked up. <laughs> and they had this cool little bit in the middle of it for no reason. Yeah, this whole big art piece. It was really yeah. cool. It's a really nice, it's huge, but it's a really nice airport. Yeah. They're very efficient. Okay, we finally made it. How many hours later? Oh my gosh, 8.30 at night. It's 8.30 at night. We got to the airport at 7 in the morning. And we have just got the rental car. And we're finally starting to be excited. We're going to try to find I'm our place excited. now. Okay, let's go. Oh, yep. I gotta adjust and we'll get stuff. we'll get some footage of Boston. I don't know how these Boston are be <laughs> so here we are trying to find the hotel <laughs> and beautiful city and the water. Everything was really just gorgeous. Okay, we just got into our hotel. It's a lot smaller. It's. I forgot it was. In the pictures. This is the whole thing. I'm in the corner. Here's the front door. And you walk into the bedroom. And. 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 And that's the other side. This is, this is the entire room. Tell them where we are. Yeah, this bar was. This club was just a little bit too loud. It was very loud. <laughs> so we could talk over this. The, we had this espresso, espresso martini. martinis. So good. They had pretty good drinks. They were expensive, but the best uh, whiskey sour I'd ever had. Yeah, it was literally the best whiskey sour ever. Yeah. Spicy Rita. Spicy Rita and a s'more martini. I think even they had some kind of like Halloween type. Oh, here's the, the building you were talking about that we parked right next to. The gargoyle building? Yeah. Whoever owns this house needs to oh, give it to me. Mean, yeah. <laughs> Goth wife is in love. Boston. Double bridge. Double Liz on a double bridge. Huh? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten for the double bridge. You look the part, let me tell you. You look like like you live here. No. <laughs> got this new car. You got your coffee. You got your Big fluffy gothic jacket. I love jacket. <laughs> so this is in Salem. This in is as Salem. soon as we park, and we start seeing the decorations. Yeah, this house greeted us right when we drove in. It's pretty amazing. I was a little disappointed that more people didn't decorate. Um, this is the famous witch house. Yes, which we did not go in because it was sold out forever. It was sold out forever. And then here's Essex Street as soon as we pull up. They call this the Haunted Happenings. Oh, they do? All in October. I didn't catch this, what happens here. They make you keep 
up. <laughs> Watch his reaction. <laughs> there are like lines and lines. Lines and lines to get into anything. So this was on a Sunday. This was Sunday, and I was a little discouraged when we got here, and the lines, were, it was just this crazy. <laughs> you on Instagram. <laughs> but, I mean, these guys, everyone there with the costumes was pretty amazing. So there's these people all over in really great costumes with tips for pics. Yes. So if you wanted to get your picture taken. I watched them walking over here. Oh, you It did create an entire it's a great atmosphere. It's little October side hustle. Yeah, yeah. They probably do pretty good. This guy was amazing. Yeah, he was awesome. And then we went to the Witch City Mall. I had to get this Monsters uh, pinball here. This was cool. So the uh, stores inside the mall were really great. Here, this is the comic shop that we went into. One of the only things that didn't have a crazy line that day. Uh, kind of your normal comic shop, though. You know, nothing really too crazy about it. I mean, I had some cool masks and stuff. Essex special. The amount of people. The mall itself was kind of run down and dumpy. Like, it needs some, needs some work. Yeah. There is some talk about that online in the community as well. Apparently, the guy who owns it doesn't want to invest anything. <gasps> We should buy that mall. Okay, now we're into Black Craft, which was definitely a highlight. The biggest witch in Salem here. So this is an old bank that they turned into this shop, and it also has a haunted house attached to it. And it's a coffee shop as well. Oh, it's, they brew their shop. own coffee, yeah. yeah. And uh, yeah, it was beautiful. It was everything we would want in a business. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, a haunted house, a full-time haunted house with uh, Edgar. So they let us film the entire haunted house, which is gonna be a separate video. Uh, but the actors went there because this isn't on Sunday. This is a different day because it was a weekday. Like Tuesday. Or yeah, I think it was Tuesday. But it kind of worked out because if the actors were there, I don't think they would have let us film. Oh, maybe not. So. Oh, this was a cool van that we found. I wanted to go to that. This is the other haunted house which we were not allowed to film in. The Witch Dungeon, I think. I don't remember. No actors, all animatronics. Oh, animatronics. Whoa! <laughs> he got me on that one. <laughs> he got me too. And then you come out of that and you come into this one. The Monster Museum. Which is the newest attraction to okay. Salem, I found out. And they let us film. So this is the very beginning. Before you walk in, they give you a little lantern, which is cool. And no actors. And they let you film all the way through it. Uh, that will also be a separate video coming tomorrow. Well, it's great because it's not really a haunted house, but it's all of like the haunted creatures. Yeah. And it tells you all about It's like them. haunted house adjacent. This is not the main bougie street. Oh, there's the super Halloween house. This is just another street. All with basement. All gorgeous. Look at this. Look at that. That is beautiful. <laughs> That's the one with the real cemetery in it. In the yard. <laughs> The next day, they have their own theater, which yeah, is cool. Yeah, we missed out on the Monster Squad yeah. meet and greet. And I'm sure they were sold out completely of everything. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing was cheap. And everything was like a little marked up. Yeah, but that's to which be you, yeah, you expect that. It's kind of just a. Uh, a cool comic shop with some more kind of horror stuff. It was cool. I liked it. Did they even have comics in there? Yeah, there's a whole comic section. I just kind of cut it out. 
This is not the first church of England, which looks very similar. First church of England? I mean, first church of Salem. Oh, I thought that one was the first church. No, they look very similar. That's the one you, you walk up to. This is the one right outside the mall, which is also very oh, pretty. Oh, that's right. And we've got some of these headstones, it's which they light up at night. But it's a real cemetery there, right? Yeah, I guess so. I don't know. I mean, I... Mm. I don't think they would just put I don't, that there for I, I don't think so either. There's the Witch City Mall on the outside, and you get a shot of the people. This is what... This is this is on the next couple days when it's thinned out a little bit. Yeah. It's not so crazy. Oh, I'm talking to Vivian, a super nice lady I met. Vivian, who you met. I gave her the rest of our pizza because we couldn't finish it. Yeah, we were full. This is the t-shirt shop that had lines every day to get in. And the Piss and Moan Club. This is the outside of the witch haunted house. Did we go in that one? Yeah, this is the one where... But we didn't go on this day. The footage is kind of bouncing around. I could have done a better job editing this. Ooh, I really like this shop. Yeah, this is one of the most popular shops it seemed in uh, in the Essex little walkway this was called Bewitched in Salem, Bewitched in Salem. which I'll get the sign there you go I like their sign yeah everything everything in this shop was super cool I really like this little cool mirror thing I kind of want that <laughs> <laughs> This one is the oldest. This is the oldest church in Salem. in Salem. The first church. I tried to find a door to go inside, but there weren't any. And of course, we missed all of the Sunday morning service. Stand in front of it and do a thing. <laughs> she doesn't want to do a thing. That was the house that was in <laughs> Hocus Pocus. Yeah, the Hocus Pocus a house. Lot of people go look at that house. This is just us walking back to our car, and all the houses are so beautiful. This is one of the ones that I really wanted, and this one. <laughs> oh yeah, this one was awesome. <laughs> Built in 1729. Insane, but it's still standing. <laughs> Do you think they like got together and had like a pumpkin carving party? For I that? don't. I don't think those were carved. I think they were plastic. Oh, that's yeah. kind of dumb. This is just another one of the dozens and dozens of cemeteries yeah. all around Salem. This is just on the street. <laughs> we just walked past this. Mm -hmm. and we're like, wow. Right on the water. She go throw some tea in it. <laughs> where? It's Joe's. I mean, where are we? Oh, Boston. Downtown bougie ball. This isn't even. We're on Newberry. Is that bougie? This was the only thing that was open. We went up and down the street. The only thing that was open. Yeah. I wanted ramen. <laughs> No problem. So we're at Joe's on Newberry. This was one step away from CVS chips. No, next was going to be CVS, like a bucket of nuts and some popcorn. <laughs> Cham Clouda? Cham Clouda? <laughs> With Cham Pluffs? Cham Pluffs? Clam Puffs? Clam Puffs? Yeah. We got the oysters. Got some oysters. Getting a New England on. Good. No more filming. Now eating. <laughs> okay, we finally got up to the witch house, and this super nice lady was gonna. Yeah. Oh, that'd be great. What do you think they're from like Sweden or something? Yeah, it sounds like Sweden. Yeah. Oh, that's a video. So here's the monster museum. The outside. I really like this guy's setup. We're gonna have a whole video for this separate. Yes.
This is some of the Monster Museum. I've cut the whole thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is just a few. We'll do a full walkthrough, separate video. This was a cool <laughs> shop. The Wolf Wolf Moon. I just really like the you couch. You wanted the couch. You wanted the couch. Oh, this guy was cool. Just hustling for some tips. And these guys. Oh, this is where I lost you. This is where you lost me. <laughs> the Kakawa chocolate. chocolate house in, in Salem. And what'd you get? I got chocolate covered bacon. Chocolate bacon. Yeah, Which two favorite things. <laughs> All right, try it. <laughs> no, not a fan, huh? What did you know? <laughs> separate. Keep them separate. So this is the last day, and it's thinned out considerably. You can kind of get to what you want at this point. This is Tuesday. Tuesday, is Tuesday. yeah. Still a ton of people for a Tuesday. And this is not, this is the beginning of October. Well, not the beginning. That was the 15th. The 15th. Okay, but we're not in the home stretch of October this lady's or anything. costume was Yeah, awesome. she had some amazing contacts. It was crazy. All these performers were awesome. She even brought her own little well. I didn't even notice the well. <laughs> cool. Yet another beautiful church. <laughs> These guys were the only ones on their block, wow. and they just they went, went nuts. over the top. Yeah. It was awesome. It is awesome. <laughs> this is back at the Witch City Mall in the pizza shop. Cool. She is cool. Well, this is a cool little witch shop. You found some stuff oh, in here. Oh, yeah. I got some little trinkets for the girls. And this was the whole secondary part that we found the last day. Yeah, I forget what it was called. Oh, and then here is the cemetery with the... It's the witch memorial. Yeah, with all... I've cut this down, but it has every one of the, I think, 20 people. 20 people. Who... I think there were, there's one guy and 19 girls. I thought I saw more men. There might be two men. The famous one who was The famous pressed one who was pressed to death. Oh, wow. All the others were hung. I should have got a shot with all of them together, but... And then, and then Goose Face. <laughs> goose Face. <laughs> And then the lobster shanty. Lobster shanty was our last meal in Salem for now. Lobster roll. Uh huh. And wicked spicy crab cakes. Wicked spicy crab cakes in a place called the Lobster Shanty. We have had a very good time. So good time. We don't want to leave. We didn't miss our kids. Check out that lobster roll. Full moon. Almost in Salem. And it is cold. It's probably lower 50s. Salem trip wrap up. That was So that was our trip. That was our trip. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. No. No. <laughs> Normally I'm not in the video. I'm behind the camera. First time in the video. I've been in a couple here and there, but I never know. talking to you really. I know. You should be in more videos no. with me. And it's not called goth couple. There's already 
there's already a goth couple who we like. Shout out to them. Random goth couple. Random goth awesome. couple. Love your content. We like your stuff. But there's already that channel. Okay. That wasn't a goth wife channel. I'm going to change my name so I don't have to be by myself. <laughs> We're getting off topic. Oh, we always do that. Yes, we do. Um... It was awesome. We should be the random goth couple because we're just very random we are, all the we're, time. Shout out to them. But they're on track. You're right. They're what's the opposite of random? Planned? Planned. They should be <laughs> <laughs> You guys should be planned goth couple. <laughs> and we'll be but we're not goth enough. See, like they, they do it they're up married, and we're yeah. Which is we're awesome. like we're slacker goth couple. <gasps> oh, we're That's our new name. The slacker goth couple. Mm -hmm. Minimalist the, goth. Minimalist. <laughs> Quick. No effort goth. No effort goth. Slap on some black and go. Go. Salem. Salem was awesome. Back to the Back. topic. Salem was awesome. We loved it. We did. We, we stayed in life. Boston at night so that we could drive to Salem every day. And see all the beautiful scenery, which was amazing. Boston was beautiful. Boston we was liked beautiful. The Boston too. Those buildings were incredible. We stayed right next to this like castle-like building that had gargoyles on it. You'll see angels. it in the footage. Yes, that was beautiful. That was pretty nice. What about Salem itself? Salem was amazing. We're definitely going to go back. So for sure, going back. I say in the footage that. This seems like the Halloween capital of the world. Mm -hmm. I looked it up, and apparently there's a different city <laughs> called Anoka. In uh, Anoka? Anoka, uh -huh. which must be like a Native American name or something. Where's that? I think it's in, uh, it's up north, Montana or... Missouri? No. Idaho? Utah. There's something up there. <laughs> But they claim they are the Halloween capital of the world because they had the first Halloween parade in 1920, something like that. But well, we'll have to go there. Apparently you don't because I looked it up and everyone's like, absolutely not worth it. One quote was, if you can drive less than three miles, it might be worth it. <laughs> <laughs> so. Oh. Yeah. Well, they should change that. They shouldn't. Apparently, it's it's pretty. It weak. doesn't compete. It doesn't compete. Salem. So to me, Salem would beat out New Orleans for Halloween capital. Yeah. New Orleans. Yeah. New Orleans goes hard up there for there. Halloween. The city itself. The city itself and all of its ghosts and everything history. it does. I would put New Orleans up there. Like but number two. It, uh, yeah, I think number so. Because you have to factor in the history and the like history and the culture. The culture, not just the, but how it still is now. Yeah, it's how much they embrace there. it and how much like. To me, both those cities felt like haunted places, like on their own. Oh yeah, for sure. And there's just so much history. There's so much haunted history. Yeah, and, and real tragedies really happened there. We'll talk about it when you see the whole video because everything was just super cool and amazing. Yes. And beautiful. Yes. But I want to go back again in not in October. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> in not the in off October. Season. In the off season. Because While that was... it was a very cool experience. It was just a bit overwhelming with all of the people. And we went early. Ooh. We didn't even go on Halloween. No, don't go yeah, on Halloween, I mean, apparently. Or or, or that's part of it, or right? that's part of it. Not if you want to, like, see the sights and, like, check out the shops without standing in a line for an hour. And we'll talk about that going to be in the footage. In yeah. So all the different little haunted houses that we kind of showed you, we have separate videos of the whole walkthroughs of some of them. Yes, two of them. Oh, just two? two? Two. One of them. them, they have three. One of them wouldn't let us film, or at least, like, I didn't ask. Did they have actual actors There in were them? no actors in any of them. Some days there away. are, so but just not. Blackcraft has actors, but they weren't there for us, which is why they, why they allowed us to film. Right, because they only have their actors on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, just the weekend. 
Well, they let us film everything. But it looks like all three of them are full time. Yeah, you year can round. go to them year round, but only in high seasons do they have actors in there that actually. And uh, good for kids. There were kids in there. I think they were all really kid friendly. Real kid friendly. If you want to take a little family trip? Nothing kids like. Kids can go in there. Nothing like the real Our stuff. Our kids could go in there. Yeah. Don't know about your kids. Our kids could go in there. Nothing like the real ones that we've done down here, which are completely way too right, much for right. kids. This is all geared towards, you know, family fun and adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely bring the kids, the family. It was a lot of fun. But all in all, it was an amazing trip. We want to go back. It was a perfect way to spend our 10th anniversary. anniversary slash honeymoon we never had. Because we were married on Halloween. Halloween. Halloween night, 10 years ago. Shout out to all you people that partied with us. Because that was And that's coming epic. up. Epic. Almost. Happy Halloween. Almost Halloween. Almost Halloween. Leave a comment what you're doing for Halloween. Yes. And if you've been if to Salem. If you've been to Salem. What was your favorite part? Did you think it was overrated? Did we think it was overrated? I think, if anything, it was underrated. I guess it depends on what you're going there for. Yeah, because I feel like some parts were overrated and some parts were way underrated. That's just my opinion. You should go well, was, and find out for yourself. Well, what do you think was overrated? What do you think? They're, they're for our opinions. Oh. There's 10 people out there who give a shit what... <laughs> The Witch City Mall, I felt we like. We got a new was... subscriber. We did? Yeah. Hi, new yeah. subscriber. <laughs> yeah. The shops weren't that great. It was a little bit dirty and kind of broken down. It did need some love for sure. It definitely needs some love. That owner needs to put some money into it because it was kind of falling apart. And like the whole, it was just, you know, it was cool, but not as cool as I wanted it to be being the witch city mall yeah it was just a normal small mall a very had, tiny mall with maybe like 10, 15 it did have stores. the two haunts kind of in it, it but the two haunts in it and yeah. it had about like maybe 10 or 15 stores yeah that was the only thing what was what was undersold to you what did you like more than you expect salem in general yeah i was gonna say i that. think it was just like I don't know, just the vibe I got there yeah. was just like, I don't want to leave. It was so nice. The weather was great. The people were nice. Well, the parking did suck. The parking did suck, but we knew that going in. We knew that going yeah. in. And you can walk everywhere. It really like, you don't need a car. It, yeah, it wasn't that bad. Like That was the only thing was the parking. The, we did have to park a ways away, but it let us get to see more of the city itself. Yeah. And the houses and... The houses. I was telling somebody like if Halloween was a place, that's what Salem feels like. From, it feels like Halloween. There's no concrete that I saw in downtown. It's all bricks. Well, like and the it's historic all, part. Yes, the historic part. Still like the same brick and cobblestone ground. And cobblestones. That was there like hundreds of years ago. And the trees are so old, they buckled the streets yeah. and the sidewalks. It, it was just an amazing... I didn't expect to fall in love with it like I did. I expected yeah, to go there and we'd we'd be you know have a bunch of Halloween stuff, and then like and we'd say we went to Salem, but like now we already want to go back. We already want to go back. It it was the city itself far exceeded my expectations. Did. So oh. go definitely. If you're into go. Halloween, you owe it you're, you owe it to yourself to go. Maybe not or in not even Halloween. If you're, if you're into, into like, the history history and just like old cool things in general anything else you want to say about our 10 year anniversary love it was wonderful i'm on camera for you for me is there anything you want to say to me i love you no i love you too in 10 more years 100 uh, oh i'm oh. I'm, <laughs> I'm not ready to commit to <laughs>
until death do us part. That's so, right. like, I'm free then. What? Because somebody else wants to date you? Someone might want to date my shriveled up husk. No. The after party. The afterlife party. The afterlife. Not, the af not the after party. The afterlife party might be banging. I think that's it. I already said like and subscribe, so you don't have to cut all this out. Mm. I right, just move it around. I can move you stuff just around. Move it around. Move it around. Mam. <laughs> you're trying to make outtakes. Mam. <laughs> <laughs>